This week, we get permission for an entire block of 1860s, 1870s built houses, including an 1870s public school. This content is stretched over a week's time, consisting of three different digs featuring Wild Bill, Chris Getz, and Chris Wright. In this video, we uncover more local rares and only known bottles than we ever have before. Make sure you hold on to your shovels because this is going to get wild. We are in a 1860s, 1870s pit in another small town. Um, I'm pretty sure we have a squat soda here. I, I haven't seen much of it. Just what you guys can see right now. Right there it is. And I'm going to try to dig it out here left-handed with the old deer antler digger we got now. And we're going to hope that it's whole. Because if it is... It'll be a first squat. It's whole. It's first scary. squat. Uh, it's slick. Oh, it's oh right, man. It's slick as can be. Yeah. Look at that, guys. Little squat man. soda. Sir. Check it out. That's an early one. That's 60s all day. Look at that. Well, Look there's some age. See if there's anything else? Yeah. I think that's probably going to be it, but right up against the wall too. All right. Oh shoot. Yeah, yeah start another one, baby. I think it's a squat. It feels like it. All I could do is feel it with one finger. This antler digger is nice, bro. I'd really like it. Easy on the bottles too. Yeah. What's up? There it is. No? Is that it? No, that ain't what. That ain't nothing. There it is. Move your head left a it's, little bit, Corey. Oh my gosh, it's a flask. There's some lime back in here. Come on, be something crazy, please. Is there another bottle up against it? Possibly. I think it's a flask. Yeah, it's a flask. I don't know if it's historical or not, but. I don't even know if it's whole. I know the top's knocked off of it. It's early as can be. Civil War era seems sad. Mm. I'd stay in well, I'd stay yeah, in the I don't know what that is. It might just be a chunk of coal. It is. I think that's going to be it for now. Seen something weird looking. Yeah, yeah I'm coming down. All right, guys. So literally seconds, seconds later, I just there must have been like a can. It was in a can. You can see the rust, the circle of the rust of the can, just rolled right out. I mean, literally just rolled out of that sure. can. But this one's embossed. I think it's way back there. Oh, come on, baby. What is this? Queen, Queen, Queen City. City. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. Yes. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh. Bro. That's, that's epic. Unbelievable. That's a miracle. That's Queen amazing. City Bottling House Squat Soda, baby. Look at this, guys. I can't even get it clean to show you. It's Queen City Bottling House, Cumberland, Maryland. <laughs> what? In a little tiny town here. Wow. It's Gerdman and Company, Cumberland, Maryland. <laughs> On March 3rd, 1873, Queen City Bottling House was located at 277 North Mechanic Street. H. Gerdman Company were manufacturers of lager beer, porter and ale, stock porter, and stock ale. On February 2nd, 1873, Gerdman and Bergman bought out the bottling establishment of the Shriver Brothers. 
I've been looking for this squat soda for probably 10 years. I've been digging for 10 years. Finally able to be able to say that I have one of these in my collection. These do not float around very often. There's a handful of them around. However, first one for me, first one out of the privy. So, into the collection it goes. There's one more bottle down here I haven't even extracted yet. I'm gonna left hand dig it again. There's bones up in here. Like this this trash guy that's up high up against the wall. Um it's everywhere really. What's this? Oh it's that bottle. Oh it's amber, it's an amber flask. Oh, it's back in there a little ways. I'm gonna try to get it out for you. Left handed. I know. This is cr oh, there's another bottle behind it, I think. Oh, Maybe. It might be cool. A lot of things in there good. Is that a pipe? Nope, bone. Uh, that's a piece of coal. Yeah, there might be something else back here. I feel glass, I think. Here it comes. Nothing? No. It ain't nothing. But it's amber. Slick Real drippy lip. Yep, slick. Not even an anchor on it. Usually we get anchors around here. But, huh. Well, I don't know if I take or not. I think that's gonna be it for now, guys. Uh, Possibly. <laughs> I said that last time and squat pops out of the wall. There's something broke back there. Piece of lantern. That's gonna be it for now. Alright guys, another squat soda. Another squat soda, baby. <laughs> this is insane, Chris. Sir, hope they keep coming. Yeah, I know. What's this? I felt something. There's a piece of pottery. I felt like something down in there. There is another layer down under that clay, but it's very, very small. I don't know if there's going to be any glass in it or not. It's all cold down in it. Yeah, it's a little cold in one corner. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's looking good for us. Come on, baby. Queen City Bottling House. Oh, yeah. Queen City room. Bottling House, baby. Come on. Take this right here above you, Corey. Just a little bit. Oh. You're good. Okay. Oh, there's another one behind it. I just felt it with the on deer stick digger. Deer antler digger. That's the best thing in the world. I know. I Here we saw. go. Here it comes. I think it's a slick, but... Nice. Another squat. <laughs> another guys. squat soda, baby. Yeah. Heck yeah. Oh, man. I swear there was something behind it. Let's see. Maybe. Maybe I touched it. Nope. Nope. There it is. Another squat. Another squat, guys. <laughs> you see it? Oh yep. my gosh. What is that? That's a flask, baby. Come on, be historical. Be historical. Be historical. 
keep searching and it doesn't come out. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping. Ah, it's in there good. They're tight. Yeah, the neck's up here somewhere. Well, let's hope the neck's up here somewhere. It's on there. Neck's on there. Yeah. It don't I look historic. What looks is. Gosh, it's in there good, buddy. That's the left hand. It's that corner of the flask. Hanging on there. There it comes. Slick. Just a slick seam side. Doggone it. Well, I mean. Can't complain. No. <laughs> can't complain, huh? No, sir. All right, guys. I'll keep going down the wall of the pit. Before we filled it. Check it out, baby. Sniped one out. Just like that. It's an early flask. For sure. Oh, yeah. Nice old seam side. Just missed pawn them, too. I mean, these are some early bottles, guys. Nice drippy lip on them. That's right. Thank you. That was actually it for that pit. Um, it was only about two and a half foot deep, three foot deep max. It did go back to mid 1860s. Unfortunately, we did not get any historical flasks or anything like that out. Um, I am going to be looking forward to digging a historical this year. I know it's going to happen. We've been in some super old pits. But um, we ended up the next day going to a yard very close to this one and poking into a hole that turned out to be ruined by a sewer line. And uh, once we get into that, that hole, we realized that it ran through one behind it as well. So we completely left the yard, went, got another permission, which ended up getting us permission for an entire block of privies. And that's what you're about to see now. All right, so we're in a different yard. That other hole had a pipe running through it, of course. Ruined everything. It's huge and, and it sucks, but it was turned in the century to 1920s, so we went ahead and filled it. We're in another yard here and we got a 60s, 70s looking hole. It's the kind of stuff we got coming out so far. Look at this little guy. Little smooth base. Probably late 60s, early 70s. Nice applied lip on there. And then a little tiny like salt with a basket weave. Check, check this out. I have no clue what this was. Ain't never seen anything like it. Look at that applied lip. What the heck is that? It's a bottle. That ain't a bottle. You sure? Yeah. It's a bottle. No, some kind of tray, dish. ash tray or dish. It's cool for being that early. An ounce in a million pieces. Got a full bottle. Do you have a full bottle? Yes. I'm gonna get down here, guys. It's crazy. As soon as I turn the camera on the video, well, we got you. It ain't pawned, but it's early. It's embossed. Boof. Acme blacking. Yep, they are, they're always damaged too. I'd watch doing that because it's probably cracked all yeah, over the is. place. Yep, bottle. cracked all over the place. These Acmes are always like it's that. Broken. Nope, it's not broke. Yeah, that it's little cool. guy. It's early too. Yeah, it is. 70s. Smooth base. Yeah, little 70s guy there. So, I mean, we got a decent pit. It comes with age. The amount of use coming out of this thing is unbelievable. I'm talking the poop is green yet. And there you can see it on them rocks. But, yeah, we got an early pit. Look at that, salt glaze. So basically what's going on, what we got going on here is underneath these steps, the pit goes all the way over to like the fence line. So <laughs> eventually we're gonna be under these steps. And we're gonna come completely around to where we can almost stand up under the steps, hopefully. And uh, we're gonna try to dig this whole thing because with the age, we don't wanna let nothing go. We're digging out Saratogas and and uh, that's actually the newest looking thing that's come out. 
definitely a bulb. But, I mean, we're digging. I'm pretty sure this was a piece of a local squat soda or mineral water. Teal. Saratoga's buried, but a piece of a broken okay. Saratoga. Broken. What is it? Squat? I think so. I had a B on the bottom. B something. BR. Big beer, big tall court beer, probably 70s, maybe. But uh, we'll get oh. back to you when we get done. seconds later. Definitely a 70s looking whip on that lantern. Unfortunately, went hole in it. Hold it. Got something. I'm gonna get your shovel. Getting the beast. Is it going that way? Baltimore piece of that Davis and Miller, isn't it? Oh no, that's some uh, mocha wear. Nice. We got the age. Definitely got the age. You guys can actually see the wood wall down under there. These roots are just insane. Is there a bunch of them? Oh yeah. These little ones? Uh-huh. Yeah, there is a lot. Really popped up the tiniest little guy. Look at that little thing. We're in a, like I said, we're in a, I think the newest stuff in here is 80s. And then we go all the way back to 60s. What's that say? 70. W. M. H. Brown and brother, Baltimore. Definitely 80s. Pretty neat, eh? Yeah. Usually the small ones I got ain't lost. It's getting to be. How the, uh, how the hell does this happen? I don't know. It's not cool though. <laughs> but I'm going underneath the steps. It's definitely early. It's a, we oh, think it's, it's a step it's down. Real early. Oh. What is it? I don't know, but I can tell you this much. We them boys. Are you? We them boys. You are too. Am I? Yeah. I can tell you somebody we dig better than. <laughs> is that SCA and right, Collar? Oh man, it might be SCA and Collar. Let me check. Oh my gosh, guys! <laughs> hey, Lachlan Wheeling, West Virginia. Is it really? Yep. Sure enough. Seven, six, late 60s. Yeah, late 60s. And it's deep. Nice, baby. What'd you say, Corey? A step down? You think yeah, it is? Step down pit. I'm sitting. You can see over here. Show them its wall. You can see the wall. There's the wood. Wood wall. And it's only this deep where I'm sitting up here. And then it steps down. This, this is probably a step for the privy dippers. Um, there is, you guys can see where the use starts down there, that tan brown looking stuff. That's all poop. This is a good one. You get into that much use, you're usually talking decent amount of bottles. Hopefully. Not all the time, but we even got stuff up high coming out. Um, it's definitely a good bottle, ain't it? Huh? Definitely a good bottle. Yeah, yeah. Alright, we'll get back to you guys if we get anything else coming out of the hole. Hole. Oh. All right, so here oh. we are down in the hole My bones under the steps. Hey, Billy. Hey. Getz is here somewhere. We need to go move his truck. And uh, I just scooped out a little druggist. We are in an early pit, 60s, 70s on the bottom, 80s, 90s. 80s on the top. And uh, well, there's some 70s mixed in up high too. But uh, check it out, guys. This is going to be probably, I already seen embossing on it. There it is. I see it. Yeah. What do we got here? A Campbell Brothers out of Cumberland, Maryland. Square Drugstore. Nice. It's a good one.
Got a Cumberland Drugger. That's that's a '70s med, guys. Yeah. '70s square. Got a Cumberland. Yeah. Campbell's Cumberland, Maryland. Nice. Square. All right. Check it well, out. Got another early one down here. <laughs> All right. Yeah, here we go. Shires, Shires Pharmacy, Cumberland, Maryland. Yeah. These are early drugstore bottles, guys. These square ones here. Late 70s, early 80s. Nice. Shires Drugstore, Cumberland, Maryland. Nice. Digging under the steps was a success. Um, we filled the pit, got a few bottles, 15, 20 bottles, when it was all said and done, anywhere from 1870s to 1880s. We did have some nice broken criers come out, like Saratogas and local mineral waters. Um, however, we went to the other side of the yard. We are in a duplex, and we dug one of the four pits on the other side of the yard, and you're going to see that right now. Alright guys, so we are digging a schoolhouse lot. Bottle. You got a bottle already? Billy's got a bottle already, so we go ahead and check it out. New? No, I didn't move. Huh? I can tell by a screen shot how it moved. It's 1910, 1915. Yeah. <coughs> okay. Alright. Definitely 1910, 1915. Got bubbles in it. See the base, yeah. But uh, we're just in a pit. The pit that we want is right here. The pit that we're in is it's a square. It's looking decent. Ironstone coming out of it. 1910 stuff. We're gonna get down here and pop it open, and then we'll get into the loaded pit. I'm talking. So as long as I've been digging pits, I ain't never felt a pit as loaded as the one we're about to dig. So should be a good video. Ready? Yep. Alright. First, well, not the first bottle of this hole. You might be on it. <laughs> Here's the first bottle that came out. Oh, nice Souders extract. Pretty bottles. I think they go back. To, this one's early. They might go back to 80s. 80s, 90s on that. I got a bottle right here. Oh, there might be something behind it, too. That's where all the lime is, that side. Yeah. Must be where they dipped it from, that side. Yep, pressed it up against there. That piece of slate. <laughs> slate feels like bottles. Ooh, I think that was another bottle back here. Those are the concrete up right here from the side of the It's a national revenue company out of New York. There's all kinds of ages in here. But once again, it's an earlier looking. 90s, turn of the century. There's, that might have been one I was just touching. Oh, what was this? Oh. Historical? Yeah, maybe. Oh. I don't know. Early class for sure. I wonder if there's any more of it in here. Oh, that was a bottle. Was it? Yep. It's like bring this down. The two prong works nice until you hit a couple of roots. Slate. Right there's a bottle. Oh, that's earlier. Oh, what is this? 
It's early. It's real old. What is this? Is that a Forney's? Looks like it is. Gosh, that's an early Forney's. <laughs> wow. That is an early Forney's right there, guys. Look at them dipped in panes. Let me pull something. Yep. You go ahead and switch with Billy. He, there's something. That's not what I was talking about oh, here. Is that what that is? That's an old flask. It's the same side. All right, guys, like so we dug, you guys seen the last video yesterday, we dug under the steps over there, made it look real nice. You can't tell we were even there. We just dug a hole right here, you guys saw, and now on to the good pit, which is right here. Yeah, and, uh, loaded and it's down loaded. There. Loaded. Get back here. Here's a red line pharmacy that also came out of the pit underneath the steps. It was not filmed. Um, it's unfortunate because these are awesome bottles and they're always extremely fun to pull. Another bottle where there's not a ton of them floating around, 1880s druggist. Um, crazy, crazy embossing on this thing. But you guys are not going to get to see the schoolhouse pit, Doug. Um, I'm going to go ahead and save that until next Sunday. I just had too much footage. If I would have added that pit into this one, we would have had like a two-hour video, which never hurts. However, this is going to be it. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and hang on for Sunday, because it's going to be crazy.